Do you love the taste of frosting even more than the cake? I know I do. Welcome back to the Princess Baker. I'm Lauren, and today I'm showing you how to make delicious American buttercream. This frosting is perfect for cakes and cupcakes. It's so easy to make, you only need one bowl. Plus, you'll be satisfying that sweet tooth in no time with this easy to follow recipe. So like it now, and let's get baking. To make this buttercream, you need butter, of course, extract for flavoring, today I'm using vanilla, a little milk, and sifted powdered sugar with a little salt sprinkled in. Start by placing your butter in the mixing bowl. Make sure it's at room temperature. In it goes! Set your mixer on low to begin beating the butter. This aerates it, which changes its color. Don't forget to scrape down the sides occasionally. Your butter will start out very yellow, but after a few minutes, poof, it will turn pale. I call this mellow yellow. Once you have reached the softer shade, we're ready to start adding in the powdered sugar. Scoop a little bit at a time and mix until it's fully incorporated. You can avoid that dreaded sugar cloud by covering the mixer with either a cloth or paper towel. Fun princess fact, did you know that all buttercreams are frostings? But not all frostings are buttercream. While we use butter as our base here, hence the name, buttercream, frostings can have other bases, like cream cheese or whipped cream. If you're new to my channel, hi there and welcome. Each week I share recipes and fun decorating tips. So like, share, and subscribe to see what we can make together next. Keep adding that powdered sugar. You're looking for the frosting volume to increase. This is what leads to that fluffy texture. It looks like snow. You can thin out the buttercream by adding a little bit of milk or even heavy cream for a decadent taste. Next, let's add our flavoring. There's so many to choose from. If you don't want to add extra color to your frosting, you can also use a clear extract. Continue adding your powdered sugar until all of it has been integrated into the frosting. You're almost there. Here's a really great frosting tip. Want to make your frosting really white? Add purple. Purple is on the opposite side of the color wheel from yellow, so adding just a tiny drop in your buttercream can counteract the hue. It's like magic. And of course, if the mystical purple power isn't enough, a little bit of white gel color never hurts. Just look at the difference. And you're done. You've made beautiful buttercream. If you don't want to stick with white, a drop or two of gel food coloring will transform your frosting into any shade you wish. Now you have delicious buttercream frosting to use on cupcakes, cakes, in cake pop dough, and even in between macaron shells. I hope you enjoyed making buttercream frosting with me. Make sure to like and subscribe for your next adventure with the Princess Baker.